Hi everyone and welcome to this new project. What we're going to do today is we're going to make a Christmas ornament with a shatterproof bulb and we're going to put some snow inside and some little decoration. I have some berries and a little bit of greenery and I'm also going to use some charms. So what you'll need to do once you've gathered your supplies, I also just take a piece of cardboard to make a funnel, or you might have a plastic funnel in your kitchen, you can use that as well. And you also need some um, some salt, coarse salt to make the snow for inside the ornament. So you're gonna take your funnel and put some snow on the, on, on the inside of the ornament. You wanna fill about halfway up. So do that step and we'll meet back here. Okay, and we're back. So now we have the snow in the ornament and the next step is to add our berries, our greenery, and I also have a little snowflake charm here that's going to be added as well. So there we go. So this is a shatterproof ornament. I'm not sure if I'd mentioned that before. It's great if you have little kids or you have pets in the house. You don't have to worry about glass shattering everywhere. So there's different things you can use. Today we're using berries and a bit of greenery. And I'll use a little snowflake charm here. You can do a little winter scene with uh, little people playing in the snow, snowmen, different things like that. Uh, there are certain things if you want to add to your ornament to make like a winter scene, you would have to cut the top, cut part of the top off with a pair of scissors or an exacto knife, very carefully of course, and then once your ornament is all in place on the inside you'd have to glue the little people you'd have to glue the little houses or whatever you're using in your ornament glue it down and then what you would do is you would use a ribbon thick enough to cover that hole that you made so you'd use a ribbon on on that back side of the ornament and then you could put a bow to cover it on the top part to kind of go that would go down on each side and cover the hole. So here's our ornament that we've made today. How pretty is this? Let me know how this project worked out for you. Um, please subscribe to the channel for more videos and leave your questions and comments underneath the video. And I'll see you in the next project.